What's up, what's up, fellow Gaming Wars? Chief Rocky here with another episode of Imperial Galactic Survival here on the Shattered Realm server. As you can see, we are on Solaria. Um, <laughs> this area is just constant fog, which actually plays very good to what we need. It provides cover. I like it. Um, as you can see, we found this island out in the middle of nowhere. And you can see where I've also picked where we're going to put Outpost X-Ray. This island looks very similar to the first island we found. Um, so we're probably going to set up a pretty decent uh, outpost here. Um, but I remember the la before the last two resets, we found an island very similar to this. And I think I think we're going to we're pretty much going to keep this one. All right. Um, we, we like it. Um, and now that, you know, we got a constant fog here, it actually helps us out. But while I was exploring around, I found this drone alley. You can see the MXSE, which I didn't really like, anyways. Uh, it, it went down. I had a swarm of like over 15 drones just come at me out of nowhere. I tried to fight them off, but they hit the cockpit, and that's why I didn't like that design. So <laughs> I'm going to put the screenshot in here because you guys are going to want to look, look at it. <laughs> I went back with the Argentavis trying to save what I could. I got what I could and got out of there. Argentavis being a lot more maneuverable than the MXSE. But the only thing with the Argentavis is, is it costs more because it's all tier two stuff. So uh, we couldn't really afford to get it in at the time in the starter. Uh, so I'm going to work on a, like a starter SV for the faction uh, that's a little bit more protected. That that one's just not going to work. So anyhow, um, let me show you around right now at base command. It's about to turn dark, so what we're going to do is I'm going to show you this, uh, and then we're going to go fight those drones. Uh, and I'm going to keep killing them until uh, we brought in a, a F1 interceptor, obviously. The top of the line SV for Obsidian Syndicate. Real sleek and sexy looking craft. Obviously the Argentavis, you can see I've taken some battle, da <laughs> battle damage. But surprisingly enough, right, this troop transport slash... Uh, slash hauler utility vehicle um it held up pretty good man it it, it did the job those two mini guns up here were, were screaming <laughs> but it got it uh you can also see we got the zion and her sister ship the ark we had so much stuff in zion that we didn't want to move her she had to stay here and she became base. she is still permanently the base um we're going up there making sure the food prot and everything is going to go good to go and all of the stuff is getting sorted of her um, we got our two heavy miners we got a third heavy miner and we brought in our new LHC 01 vulture this is our heavy big trader she has turrets but the turrets are meant for protection only it can fight back it could be kind of lethal but it I don't I don't expect it to win any fights when it comes to uh, PvP ships. More or less, just gonna uh, scare, uh, try to fight its way into uh, warping out. Uh, but it's really meant to land on planets, uh, mine some stuff, bring it back up here. You can see Brain Drop. I think he's uh, away right now. <laughs> um, yeah, land on planets, mine up a whole bunch of stuff. Uh, I'll go through and, and show you that later. Uh, but right now I'm, I'm about actually it's about to turn dark <laughs> I'm gonna make sure that uh, the eviscerator has everything in it ammo everything and then we're gonna fight those drones until I reach le uh, max level hopefully more until I die which is gonna be kinda hard in this um, and then as well we have about two hours and 24 minutes left on the new updated outpost x-ray and I'm so excited so excited a lot of the downfalls that I had with it uh, we were able to fix and as you can see all this stuff here we mined brain interrupted a incredible amount of work taking this new vulture out into outer space and collecting as much as we could plus the majority of it came from the Zion that's what was so hard for us to leave the starter planet it was so damn full even the ammo and the refrigerator were full of whatever we had this and this and the H, uh, HYD up there and that other MS whatever piece of crap that was full of stuff attached to this and we just found it very hard to get off the planet. So anyways, 
Uh, let me make sure that the eviscerator is up and running, and then as soon as it turns daylight, we are taking off, and we're going to go kill some drones. All right, so we are ready. I got enough homing missiles in there, just a couple dummy missiles, enough machine gun ammo or minigun ammo. Uh, my belly's full, got plenty of oxygen, and just in case we die, I have right here a motorbike. So we're ready to go. Let's go kill these things. So I am <laughs> not in trying to get anything out of that crashed ship. Only because these things were respawning at such a rapid pace, it was ridiculous. So, alright, everything good with it? Everything's good. Alright, here we go. You guys will see the little fog cover right here. It actually gets kind of thicker sometimes too, so. Alright, let's turn around and let's go over here. So, <laughs> this is going to get very intense very fast, guys. Oof. Make sure we got everything here. Don't think we're going to hit anything with the dummy missiles, but just in case. Alright. Getting close. We'll see a couple red dots here in a minute. see where we're at with XP here okay let's see if we get to 25 let's see either that or uh, <laughs> we die oh drone valley there they are oh crap no that's my ship are they around it nope here they are though Nope, no homing lock. No homing lock. Damn a lag spike. Not the time to have a lag spike. No! Come on, stop wasting the, the homing rounds. So these minigun drones are the worst. Got him. Too close. Cheater.
Oof. It says it's still got four. Let's check the front. Let's see what I got here. Okay, just missing that one angled block. And more just bond in. Alright, now you see why I call this Drone Valley. This is this a minigun or a rocket? Uh, minigunner, can we get him from a distance? Come on, it was locked, bro. What the hell? <laughs> They've been chewing at this thing. <laughs> oh man. Do so I got any more? Do I got any more? They seem to be dying down. Oh, nope, nope. No, I hate these minigunners. So this thing, obviously, the interceptor is built to intercept. It's a lot faster, a lot more maneuverable, uh, enclosed cockpit. The only thing is it was designed a couple alphas ago. So it is a little underpowered, as you can see, uh, but it still gets the job done. That's something we'll probably look at revamping it. But this is a faction design. It is a PvP design, which means that it will not be ever released to the workshop <laughs> until uh, we get compromised and it goes away. But this is a uh, this is actually the Interceptor version two uh, off of Garces when he was with us. Uh, he designed this for the faction and gave us the permission to keep it. Where are we at with XP? Damn, almost a level 22. Good show, guys. Good show. So these guys seem to have calmed down a bit. Is there anything in there I need? Let's make sure that the... No, so i got to open those. I don't want to go flying out of this thing. Let's see if we can open the shutters from here. Da 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 da. Show on HUD. Awesome. Ah, oh, there goes another one. <laughs> right as I turned around. All right, this is a lot easier than before. Oh, they're starting to come back a little bit more powerful, huh? Are you a mini gunner? Oh, yeah, he's a mini gunner. Let's get on top of you. So yeah, again, um, this ship is definitely a lot more agile than that, uh, which was what I was actually going around scouting the planet off in uh, when I found old Drone Valley right here. I 
and I initially came back in the Argentavis to try to get my backpack before despawned. But of course, uh, the Argentavis, as agile as she is, is not really meant to uh, engage in a crap ton of drones like the Interceptor is. Says something's here. Or is it a dead one? I think it might be a dead one. I don't know, it has it moving around. What are we doing here? Where are you guys at? Huh? Now that I came, you don't want to come out and play no more. So yeah, obviously you saw in the screenshot that I uh, put in the video, there was quite a bit of these guys. Um, it was it was pretty intense. I don't know because I killed a lot of them off that they uh, they're not coming back in such a heavy amount or what I don't know um, but I thought it would be a good idea to come and show you guys that on the Shattered Realm on PvP planets <laughs> they're they're pretty intense level 8 spitting bugs uh, those were pleasant um, r random Xerax patrols in, in, in random areas of the map um, at level 8 um, yeah very 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 intense alright so these guys seem to be uh... let's see if we could get this ship to drop and see if we could pull anything out of it that we don't need I actually gotta start refilling the tank here I got two minutes left anyways alright here we go yeah, just what I thought okay Well, at least it didn't clip me in. All right, that's awesome. <laughs> All right, open that up. I'm good at O2, so. Alrighty, let's go into registry. Do here we go. Control panel. Let's power her off. There she goes. She's dropping. Let's go park next to her. Alrighty, what do we got in here? Okay, we'll take that. That's definitely always use some meat. And the ammo would always be nice too. Alrighty. What else? Oh. Always use fuel. Alright, natural solution. Let's see as we can get as much as we can. Alright. All right, let's go over here. Put what we can in here. If we could put anything in here. Let's see. Da 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 da. Cargo box. If I put fuel in here earlier. I think we can still fit some in here, but I think we're gonna max out. Again, not designed to carry a lot. What we can do right now is we can exit this. Fill it up. We gotta keep an eye on that mini map too. Come back in here. Take that out. Take that out. There we go. So that should free up a little bit more space for us. Leave the meat with us. We could put there there take that out we don't need that there alrighty
Or we could come and strip this down later. I mean, they took all the important, really expensive stuff that I would want to keep. Um, for the most part. But we could just come and get it for parts. So we could spawn some other uh, SVs in rather quickly. But yeah. Um, so that was an entertaining trip. <laughs> I'm just kind of glad we got a lot back from it. Let's see if there's any drones around for us to go kill before we leave. I was hoping that there would be a crap ton. Because earlier they just kept spawning and kept spawning and kept spawning and kept spawning. I mean, it was it was just non-stop. Just non-stop. But what, what I heard from uh, Raven and Braindrop is that the last time we found this on the first iteration of us playing, right before the third wipe, or the second wipe, um, we had found it on Solera, Solaria, around the same area actually, and once they, once a server restart happened, it kind of st stopped happening at the uh, escalation it was before, so they said ones or twosies were showing up, but I mean, we still caught a good amount, that was a good amount in that short period of time. Uh, but I'm, I'm going to frequent back here just because of the constant XP that it provides. Uh, it, it's kind of cool. So, But I did run into a Xerax patrol up here earlier in the Talon area trying to get me some ooh, iron. Trying to get me some Sathium. And I had to, I had to really kind of scatter away from them. They were, they had some rocket troops. <laughs> they kept effing me up. Let's see if I can find them. So that's where I was mining the sathium out of. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Yeah, right here. Boom. 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 I just love watching those guys jump. <laughs> yeah, guys. Now you can't kill me. <laughs> I wish I could teabag you. Alright. Take their stuff. So yeah, you'll... Um, and that's one thing I really do enjoy about... Uh, this server is... There, there's quite a bit of uh, nasty stuff. <laughs> to run into. So... Um, yeah, it, it definitely keeps you busy. Even when you're exploring... You're gonna find some uh, <laughs> some very unique stuff. Let's see. Can we put this here? We sure can. Can we eat any of this? You know what? I really don't need this. Can we throw this out? Yeah. You know, I can't give it to you either, huh? Uh, la, 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 la. Stomach pills. Hmm. 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 Yeah, it's not that important. We could go. I thought they had credits or something. So anyways, guys. Uh, yep, here you go. This is the F1 Interceptor. Uh, actually, I think it's the F1 Interceptor Mark II. Yep, Mark II. It's the the Obsidian Syndicate faction version. Uh, Garces has his own that he uses with whatever faction he's usually with. Uh, if he considers coming back, I know he's probably going to consider coming back to us because he loves us so much. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to head back to the base. It should be right around time for me to spawn in the base. Actually, let's check. One hour and 26 minutes. So we'll go and uh, get this thing repaired. Power up the base. And get ready to spawn this thing in. I might come back and salvage this stuff. I definitely want to see if more drones spawn here. 
definitely want to check that out. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm once I left the starter planet, uh, things just got a lot more interesting. This planet is massive as hell. Just I, I've been running around trying to. This is all I've really gotten in the last couple days. And look at this. There's yes, still so much more. So. Yeah, it, it's gonna be if we could get enough PVPers on this planet, <laughs> it would. It's gonna be hard to actually find each other. So, I'm excited to see what happens. So, if you want to join up in the Shattered Realm, the uh, look at the description below. All the information's there. You can hit me up in Discord. I can give you all the information as well. If you would want to join us in Obsidian Syndicate, information's down below as well. That's all I got for you guys. Chief Rocky out. Thank you.